Well, hey everybody, it's your pal Johnny O, and you are back in the pot garden. Today we've got kind of a special project for you. It's simple, very easy, easy as pie, as they say. What we're going to be doing is sprigging uh, about 10 of these holiday cactus. And uh, they all came from this mama here, which uh, I bought back in uh, November of uh, 19. And it has gotten huge. It was about this size when I got it. And so I'm going to be breaking off um, some shoots. And I'll show you how we're going to do this. First of all, I'm going to take our root boost. I'm going to take some of that uh, hormone powder right there. It's a little breezy out here. I'm going to stick it right there. Uh, and what I have in here is my Fertilone Root and Bloom Fertilizer. And uh, I'll dip these. Uh, in there before I put them in the dirt from here to the hormone into the dirt so here's what we're going to do if you can get a look at this I'm going to take just twist right here you can see I've got a you know maybe two inches I'm going to take this I'm going to dip it tail first there Take it there, take my spoon, and I've actually saturated the dirt that's in here in my Fertilone root and bloom. I'm gonna take that and just shove it right on down in there about three quarters of the way of that first little nodule. And then, let's pick out another likely suspect here. Here's one that looks good. I'm gonna just give that a, a 180 degrees here. We'll dip it in our Fertilone root and bloom. We'll go to the root boost hormone. We'll take our spoon, bam, and we'll stick another one in here. Notice they're facing in different directions. And, and that's just so it'll look fuller in, in a little, in probably three months, it, it'll fill out a little bit. Now let's get something kind of, here we go. This looks good. You could actually probably do 40 out of this without changing the character of that plant. All right, let's dip it right in the uh, root and bloom into the hormone. And we're going to take uh, the spoon and give that one a little straight up angle there. And we'll shove it on in. And, and that's it. That, that's all there is to it. Here's one that I did in uh, April of last year. Um, it looked just like this when it started. These bloomed beautifully during the holidays. And uh, that was in, uh, in less than a year. So um, there you have it. One of the easiest things in the world to do is sprigging your holiday cactus. Whether it's a holiday cactus, a Thanksgiving cactus, a crab cactus, or whatever kind of cactus you have for the holidays that blooms, remember, just because the name says cactus doesn't mean they don't need water. Treat them just like you would any other house plant when you water. Uh, these prefer to dry out, saturate it all the way through, let it dry out again, and you will have beautiful cacti. Well, that's going to wrap it up for this one. Johnny O saying I hope I'll see you next time right here on your pot gardener.